Okay. Hi guys, Courtney here from Love Yourself Lean with another exercise demo for you. This one is a fantastic finisher after a great full body or leg workout. You're going to finish it off with a wall sit with a little bit of a twist. It looks like this. So if you've done a wall sit before, you're going to be familiar with this exercise. If not, I'm going to go through some explanation so you feel comfortable and confident with understanding of how to do a wall sit properly. Your goal is to sit down in a squat position with your back pressed against the wall, your shoulder blades nice and flush, again opening that chest right up. You want to drop the glutes down so that you're at a 90 degree. So you want to be able to look down and say, okay, my hips, my knees are in a line and I see that 90 degree angle. So a regular wall sit would be, you're here and you're trying to hold yourself for as long as you can. That could be 15 seconds to start, it could be all the way to two or three minutes, like some of my boot campers. But again, start where you feel the most comfortable. Again, focus on that strength and stay there. Now I'm gonna add a bit of a twist to this. So I get you to incorporate your shoulders as well. So you're gonna feel that burning sensation in your quads, you're gonna feel your legs tremble, now we're going to throw in some shoulder work there as well just to round out this body weight exercise to make it a really good challenge for you and a great way to finish your circuits. So again, you're going to do a few circles clockwise, a few circles counterclockwise. So again, you're going to feel that in your quads and in your arms as well. So again, your goal is try to get at least 30 seconds. If you can, start at 15. Each and every week, work up to get yourself stronger to a maximum hold of 60 seconds. All right, that is called a wall sit with arm circles. Give it a try.